Frames, flags, and florals. Hand-drawn embellishments for beginners. All it takes is some simple doodles and shapes to amp up your notes, planner pages, and more. In this video, we'll show you our favorite pens and techniques to add embellishments. Here are our top gel pens for embellishing hand lettering. Uniball Signal, Sakura Jelly Roll, and the Pilot Juice. We also enjoy using fine liners to hand letter. Our favorites are Sakura Pigma Microns, Marvi Le Pen Marker Pens, and Stabilo Point 88s. Use banners and frames around text to make them stand out. To make a simple banner, draw two parallel lines. Then add sideways Vs in between the lines to make a flag. You can vary it up by doing curved lines. 3D banners are also easy to create. Just remember to keep lines parallel and fill in the appropriate shadows. Now let's try making a frame. The most basic frame is a rectangle inside of another rectangle. To make it more interesting, add patterns and lines in between the rectangles. You can change the shape of your frame with added curves. Creating bunting and flags is an easy way to add a fun touch. Simply draw a curved line and add your flag of choice along the line. You can do regular flags, triangle flags, or semicircle flags. Dividers and arrows help you make clear sections. Dividers can be as simple as two lines with a dot in the middle. Here are some of our favorite dividers. There are many ways to draw arrows. You can stick with plain arrows, or be more adventurous with block arrows and other embellished arrows. Adding leaves and flowers gives hand lettering a sweet and rustic feel. To draw a basic leaf, draw a line, and then make a teardrop shape around it. To create a whole branch, add a bunch of these together. Change the shape of the leaf, or add details on the leaf to create different looks. Drawing flowers can be as simple as creating circles, or cloud shapes. Here are some of our favorite flowers to draw. For an elegant and sophisticated look, add loops and flourishes. Loops can go in the same direction or the opposite, depending on your preference. Flourishes can be added to the ends of letters or act as standalone embellishments. A common one is this flourish, but here are some other ones you can try. Combine any of these embellishments to create stunning hand-lettered pieces. Here, we use leaves to make a frame around our lettering. In this example, we use a banner, florals, flourishes, and a frame. The combinations you can create are endless. Be sure to check out our other videos for more hand lettering and calligraphy tips. Which embellishment is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below.